Hi guys and welcome to my Mass Effect gameplay. So we start with the next mission on the list is Vermeer. So without further ado, let's get to it and see what happens. So if I'm not mistaken, this is the mission where I can choose to kill Vex if I want to and lift leave. Then or Williams behind. So So yeah, there's that. Let's scan this planets for your click. Okay, I am going to take Vex and Williams with me just because I can lose them and Commander, I'm reading a signal. I would rather Must be on like to have them on my team. Check out those defense towers. Drop the Mako. We'll go in hot and take them out. I'll get you in underneath their radar, Commander. I have to be really careful to not kill Vakes because, because I Stay out like of range and continue a basic maneuver until I bring those AA towers down. I know the drill. Meet you at the camp once those towers are offline. Joke around. See the equipment at squad real quick. Oh, Vex has been out of combat for some time. Equipment. Let's see. Stay, maybe. Yeah, let's go with that. Disable. Anti-aircraft towers. Okay, let's get to it. Okay, there are a bunch of gates around here. So 
this will be interesting. Here I can go actually not yet. Tolly with me. I think she has the caption skill. This is where we can go left or right. We basically come into the same area, but we can go around here if we want. But I 
let's go over here first to take them out and get a bit of XP. As much as I love having me ground, sometimes the driving is really unlike to say. At least on PC. works on consoles but on PC is really annoying sometimes. Down, Commander. On approach to the Solarian base now. Out. Ready to move, Commander. Okay, guys. Then let's move.
Or maybe not. It's not even for me. It's for Garrus. More trouble reaching the camp. One don't think I don't get this. Where is my first aid skill? Touchdown at the base, but it looks like we're grounded. The Solarian captain can explain when you get here. There's the Solarian camp. So, what are we supposed to do now? Stay put until we can come up with a plan. Are you in charge here? What's the situation? I'm Captain Kirahi, 3rd Infiltration Regiment, STG. You and your crew have just landed in the middle of a hot zone. Every AA gun within 10 miles has been alerted to your presence. That's just great. What now? We stay put until the Council sends the reinforcements we requested. We are the reinforcements. What? You're all they sent? I told the Council to send a fleet. We couldn't understand your transmission. They sent me to investigate. That is a repetition of our task. I lost half my men investigating this place. So what have you found? Saren's base of operations. He set up a research facility here, but it's crawling with Geth and very well fortified. Is he here? Have you seen him? No, but his Geth are everywhere and we've intercepted some comms referring to Saren. This is his facility, there's no doubt about that. What's Saren researching? He's using the facility to breed an army of Krogan. How is that possible? Apparently, Saren has discovered a cure for the genophage. What's so important about curing this genophage? It was the solution to the Krogan problem. We introduced the genophage to the Krogan population after the uprising, to quell their numbers. Without it, the Krogan will quickly overrun the galaxy. And these Krogan follow Saren. The Geth are bad enough, but a Krogan army, he'd be almost unstoppable. Exactly my thoughts. We must ensure that this facility and its secrets are destroyed. Destroyed? I don't think so. Our people are dying. This cure can save them. So this is the turning point now? If that cure leaves this planet, the Krogan will become unstoppable. We can't make the same mistake again. We are not a mistake. Is he going to be a problem? We already have enough angry Krogan to deal with. He'll be fine. I'll talk to him. I'd appreciate that, Commander. My men and I need to rethink our plan of attack. Can you give us some time? Go ahead, Captain. I'll come back soon. We won't be long, Commander. In the meantime, if you need any supplies, you can talk to Commander Rentola. 
He's in one of the tents nearby. Looks like things are a bit of a mess. Yeah. I wouldn't be so worried if it wasn't for Rex. He looks like he's gonna blow a gasket. You think I should go talk to him? It wouldn't hurt. Well, it might, actually. Just do it carefully. I'll be careful, but be ready, just in case. I'm always ready. So, I'm thinking if I actually go talk to him, I can't avoid a confrontation, but if I don't talk to him, I can save him. Maybe. Can we still trust him? We will see. That's why I saved up here. So, if I screw it up, I can load. I would really like to save him. that Rex's allegiance to you may be waning. Let's give it a shot. This isn't right, Shepard. If there's a cure for the genophage, we can't destroy it. Calm down, Rex. I'm not the enemy here. Saren's the one you should be mad at. Really? Saren created a cure for my people. You want to destroy it. Help me out here, Shepard. The lines between friend and foe are getting a little blurry from where I stand. I shouldn't have to explain that to you, Rex. Indulge me. If you can't give me a better reason than this to destroy the hopes of my people, then I'm done with you. I can't let you jeopardize the mission. So that's it. All this time and that's all I get from you. How can you not see what this means to the Krogan? This base can't be destroyed. I won't allow it. Try this. These Krogan are slaves of Saren. Puppets. Tools to be used and discarded. Is that what you want for your people? No. We were tools for the Council once. The thing was for wiping out the Rachni. They neutered us all. I doubt Saren will be as generous. All right, Shepard. You've made your point. I don't like this, but I trust you enough to follow your lead. Just one thing. When we find Saren, I want his head. Whew. I think I have enough... high enough Paragon to... influence him. Nice work with Rex. I didn't think anything would calm him down. It won't be an easy fight, but we're ready when you are. With all these defenses, Saren must be hiding something big. Okay, actually, let's have a word with him if We're we can. This. Let's go. I guess not. Then we can just go ahead and start it. Thank you for speaking with the Krogan. The assault on Saren's base will be difficult enough as it is. I assume that means you've come up with a plan. Of sorts. We can convert our ship's drive system into a 20 kiloton ordnance. Crude, but effective. Nice. Drop that nuke from orbit, and Saren can kiss his Turian ass goodbye. Unfortunately, the facility is too well fortified for that. We'll need to place the bomb at a precise location. Where do we take the nuke? And how do we get there? The bomb must be taken to the far side of the facility. Your ship can drop it off, but we'll need to infiltrate the base, disable the AA guns, and pacify any ground forces first. You want us to go in on foot? We don't have enough men. It does sound a bit risky. Is there no other way? No, but I think we can work around that. I'm going to divide my men into three teams and hit the front of the facility. While we've got their attention, you can sneak your shadow team in the back. 
It's a good idea, but your people are gonna get slaughtered. We're tougher than we look, Commander. But it's true. I don't expect many of us will make it out alive. And that makes what I'm going to ask even more difficult. I need one of your men to accompany me. To help coordinate the teams. We'll need someone who knows Alliance communication protocols. I volunteer, Commander. Not so fast, LT. Commander Shepard will need you to arm the nuke. I'll go with the Solarians. With all due respect, Gunnery Chief, it's not your place to decide. Why is it that whenever someone says, with all due respect, they really mean kiss my ass? Who would be better suited to the mission? Either of these two will do, Commander. Both seem willing to sacrifice their lives if necessary. Though if we are lucky, such sacrifices won't be required. Take Caden. Elenko, you're with the captain. Keep it simple, understood? Aye, aye, Commander. I will have the ordinance loaded onto the Normandy and brief your crew on its detonation sequencing. Do you have any questions before we go, Commander? I'm ready when you are, Captain. Excellent. Then if you'll excuse me, I need to prepare my men. Well, this is it. Don't do anything foolish while I'm gone, Ash. And that goes for you too, Commander. We'll be fine, LT. Yeah, I just... Good luck. Is there something you wanted to say, Caden? It's just weird, going under someone else's command. I've got so used to working with you. All of you. Don't worry so much. We'll see you on the other side. I know, I, um... I just wanted to say that it's been an honor serving with you, Commander. It doesn't matter if we're not in the same unit. We're still a team. Watch each other's backs, keep your eyes open, and fight like I know you can. We'll all come out of this in one piece. You bet, Commander. You all know the mission and what is at stake. I have come to trust each of you with my life. But I have also heard murmurs of discontent. I share your concerns. If we are trained for espionage, we would be legends. But the records are sealed. Glory in battle is not our way. Think of our heroes. The silent step who defeated a nation single shot. Or the ever alert who kept armies at bay with hidden facts. These giants do not seem to give us solace here, but they are not all that we are. Before the network, there was the fleet. Before diplomacy, there were soldiers. Our influence stopped the Rachni, but before that, we held the line. Our influence stopped the Krogan, but before that, we held the line. Our influence will stop Saren. In the battle today, we will hold the line. Good luck, Commander. I hope we will meet again. That was some speech. Com check. Do you read me, Commander? Loud and clear. Good. We'll start our push. We'll try to make it to the AA guns, but it might be up to you to finish the job. And Commander, if you see any way to undermine their defenses, we could definitely use the help. Okay, let's get to it. Shadow is on the ground. Repeat, Shadow is on the ground. Lieutenant Alenko with the We can't reach the guest turrets. They're out of range. Okay, let's take out the communications tower first. Okay, where to next? 
satellite hoplink tower and then a fueling path platform and yeah something scrambled the time we've got a shot lieutenant Alenko take the heat off man of I Strikes. Theodore, watch for comm stations. Alenko, can you see anything? Satellite uplink tower, so how do I disable this one? See what's over here. Let's go for the refueling station next.
Your team must be getting close. Hold on. Okay, we can go here. New facility entrance. Where we can go here. Line, man. Let's get clear of this side first before we move in. Actually, we can't go here. Must be down there. Or on top, maybe. Don't matter, let's go through here. Guards out for us, but they might be too much for Lieutenant Malenko and the Solarians to handle. Just disable the alarms. We can handle any guards inside. first Oh, you're not a gat. And you're not wearing a lab coat. I guess I'm glad to see you. Lieutenant Gonto Imness of the 3rd Infiltration Regiment, captured during recall. I assume the fleet was called in to destroy the base? Transmission wasn't clear. The fleet's not coming. I see. Then you must be the infiltration team. I know the captain. He will want this facility destroyed. My team was altered, indoctrinated. He knew about the breeding grounds. But the indoctrination is a greater threat. And far more horrifying. I watched good people reduced to mindless tusks. There isn't anything left. Others died during the experiments. I ended them. Do you know anything about the experiments they were conducting? They were studying indoctrination. Symptoms. Progress. Saren uses it to control his people, but I don't think he fully understands it. I don't know much else. I, I just saw what it did to the others. It turned them into empty husks. I can't end up like that, please. Let me out. 
I'm opening your cell. But then you're on your own. Don't look back and hope to outrun the blast, hmm? A better chance than I had before you showed up. Thank you, human. And good luck. You'll need it. No threat here, Commander. This is... horrible. Oh, this is no way to treat a prisoner. Kill them, sure, but leave them like this. Open the doors. Give them a chance to outrun the blast. You sure, Commander? Just leave them wandering? I can't stand the thought of being like that. I'd want to be put out of my misery. Let them out. They won't hurt us. If that's what you want, Commander. I just hate leaving them like this. The bones are almost full of What do you want? I told you everything. I... Who are you? Alliance, right? I knew someone would come. It tried to break me, but it couldn't. I shut it out. Slow down. I need to know where you came from. Private Maino Savata of the 3rd Infiltration Regiment, STG, sir. Captured well on reconnaissance six days ago. Glad to answer, sir. Never any questions from these bastards. Just whispers and poking and cutting. I said anything to get out and get some payback. That's not too much to ask, is it? A little payback? What do they do to you, soldier? Experiments, but I don't know what for. The effect of incessant whispering on my shortening temper. Who knows? I just need out. Something's not right here, Commander. If we don't let him out, he's as good as dead. We have to do something. Yes, leaving here would be bad. Very bad. It's too small and the noise just won't go away. Whispering is loud, you know? I need to get out. Let me out. Set him free. He could help us. Yes, sir. You'll find I am very good at following orders. I should be. I hear them over and over. Why are they repeated when they're so simple? So damn simple! Take him out! That didn't go well as it ended. My inventory is full. Okay, time to get rid of some things. Ok, 
Okay guys, I'm going to end it here for now, so thanks all for watching, feel free to comment on the video, edit it up or down, share it around, subscribe and all that good stuff, and I will see you guys next time.